episode of Case of Card Tuesday. This marks week number 52, and it is the last episode of Case of Card Tuesday for season one. So I'm looking forward to um, obtaining some new cards and a little twist on Case of Card Tuesday for next year. So um, with that being said, I did two different sets of cases, and let me share with you the first case, um, first card that I cased. So it turned out super cute. I love, love, loved it. And of course, it's playing with the paints again. And I love how they turned out. I did four cards. And I was playing with the vellum and the foil. So in the description box, you'll see the video of the tutorial of how she did this. And I absolutely loved it. So I had to case it. So what I did was, of course, playing with my foil. And then I put um, the foil on vellum. I added your suite. I think she did personalized, no, I can't remember, but I think she did personalized cards, and I did um, more universal cards that I could be able to use, because I don't really write um, from the desk of to anyone, so I just put stuff on here that I would use eventually. So, and then for this one, it says your sweet, and I used my foil, and then I used um, that sliver of gold that she added at the end, I definitely added that personal touch, that black and white paper, I mean, it just made everything else pop. And of course I cut my dies out, um, or my filigree flowers out using my Silhouette Cameo. And then I have some coordinating sequence in the gold and the blue sequence. And then I use watercolors, like for real water paint this time. And I only use like, the one I used was maybe $2 and I got it from Target from the kids Crayola section. And it turned out, oh, I love it. It was, excuse me, it was the perfect, perfect thing to use with the watercolors. Cute. So that's that one. Oh, and then just opens like that. And this popped up on Dimension just like how she did hers. Love it. So that blue one is your sweet. And then I have a gold one or yellow one with a gold center that says congratulations. Um, so I use green and gold sequence on here and then the yellow paints super cute love the vellum and that one says congratulations and this one says happy birthday it's a green and gold again I love that foil oh my gosh super cute and then the last one I did of course I had to throw a red one in there made with love super cute and I love these filigree flowers like super super cute and then I did some variations of the watercolor so have some deep color I two-toned it this one I went outside the lines a little bit and this one I I just used the less uh, watercolor on this so super cute so yeah that's the first set of cards that I cased I really like how they turned out and I look forward to making more since I have everything that I need to complete them So then I was done with my case and card. I'm like, I just got to do this. I saw um, Shandi, who's Shandi Wash, her favorite favorites here on YouTube. She did um, a bunch of teacher gift sets or teacher tag sets. Um, I'll put the video down so you can see it. But she was selling these little tag kits. And I thought, oh my gosh, I love those. They're a great idea for teachers, as she mentioned. And I just had to make several of them because I still give things to like the receptionist, uh, you know, the front desk, the nurse, the people that I am in contact with often at my kids' school. So I wanted to make a couple of sets. So first, let me share with you, um, for, check the description box for Shandi's um, videos. So you'll be able to see the tag kits that she's selling. I think she has them for $10. So if you're interested you don't, and you can't make it on your own, you don't have the substitution that, to make what she makes, she is selling those kits. So be sure to check out the link. But this is how I cased hers. Love it. It's so cute. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Um, when I saw them, I was like, oh my gosh, I got to make some of those. So I did something a little differently. She has a um, reindeer, I believe, a print and cut reindeer or some kind of paper piece reindeer that she put at the top of her clothespin. And I didn't want to do all of that um, extra. So 
I just used some clear clothes pins that I had and then I made some tags. And this is where I'm going to put the little um, sentiment of who I'm giving it, to, giving it to on the front there. So, and that is easily detachable. So, super, super cute. I love them. So, let me open one up. And um, I, I stuck with one color. I think she has six different colors, but I stuck with one color. It made it easier for me. So, exactly how she has. She has a snowflake and, um, of course, the tag and a clothespin that closes the bag. And um, let me share it with you. And I put my tags together. Uh, I think she's saying you can give them as a gift and they can put them together. But I put mine together so they don't have to do any work. I shimmered my envelope. So pretty. Look at that. I love it. My paper bag envelope. I cut that out of craft cardstock. And then I stamped holiday. And then I got these cute little bells and some uh, gold ribbon there. Super cute. And then the tag. So I'm giving this as the gift. So I really like this little envelope there. And the tags are this. I stamped them already. They have a cute little uh, string on there. And then I glitter them up a whole lot. Oh, this has some. There we go. Glitter them up and then just stamp them with different words. Warm wishes, sending cheer, greeting. She has some tiny little red um, flat back pearls or something on there. I opted to leave those out. Just keeping it simple because I'm making quite a few. And then they can just add this tag to their um, package. So I thought it turned out super cute, right? Easy, quick, and simple. So be sure to check her out if you're interested. And then um, that's it for that. And then, yeah, this concludes my case of card series, week number 52. Everything's all done. It's a year worth of case of cards. I'll put a link in the description box of the playlist for the other 51 cards if you're interested. Thank you guys so much for staying tuned. Until the next season, like the video if you like it. Bye.